I'm sure you've heard the saying, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Well, actually, most men's trash is another man's treasure. Especially if that waste is electronic junk. You can turn a pile of old electronic parts into solid gold. So many of the connections, the clips on chips, are either gold plated or made of a small amount of gold. Whether it's chips, SIM cards, motherboards, you just need to clip it all away, pile it up, and there's a special chemical process for separating the gold out of the rest of the metal involved and refining that. First things first, tear those motherboards apart and pile them up. You can see those pins in some piles, SIM cards in another. And now time for that chemical reaction, melting away the unwanted with hydrochloric and nitric acid mixed together. That poured over top of the scrap gold, well, just give it some time. Watch what happens. And then once all that's done, you can filter it. And what's being filtered, well, check that out. A little bit of black dust emerges in there. A little at a time, and the sediment drops to the bottom. And that chemical reaction is separating that black sludge that in fact contains, you guessed it, gold. As it dries out, you'll see it start to take on that color. That brownish gold powder is just a few steps from becoming your own solid gold. Now put it into a crucible and use some induction heating or a torch. In this case, induction heating. A little borax can be sprinkled on to help it all connect. And just look at that. At the center of it all. A nice round bead of gold is forming. Now completely molten, it can be flipped and tapped out. And wouldn't you know, in that pile of junk, there was a whole lot of gold.